Hey guys, it's Mr. AJ's Tech here, and today I got a review of the Wicked Reverb and the Wicked Airline Special headphones. So right here we got the Wicked Airline Specials on the left, and the Wicked Reverb headphones on the right. So these headphones are great, they're cheap in a sense of price, not a sense of quality. They sound great. And they're not going to cost you the same price as the Beats by Dre. So uh, right here we got the over-ear headphones and these are the on-ear headphones. The difference of course is uh, this doesn't go all the way around your ear, this goes around your ear. So uh, there's, some head there's some headphone if uh, info for you. Uh, over-ear, on-ear, and then the little ones that go in your ear guess it, uh, in-ear headphones. So um, it's just kind of the way they're marketed. So uh, two different type of headphones. They run for $25 to $30. And these are the Wicked Headphones line. So Wicked um, Audio is this kind of big company and they have a bunch of different branches, but this is the Wicked uh, branch. And uh, these headphones are actually really great. Uh, of course, I'm gonna do these reviews all in one just cause they're kind of the same idea and they'll kind of uh, forward you to the right idea what you want. So uh, these are great. Um, they're for like kind of walking around. They're pretty stylish. I, I will say myself unless my style is totally out of whack. Um, they look pretty cool. They sound great and they're cheap. Uh, it'd be good for like maybe your parent getting the kids some headphones for Christmas because they asked for $400 Beats by Dre. Um, I'm going to be comparing those two just because everybody wants Beats by Dre but they're not even that good. So um, right here the Wicked Airline Specials are pretty stylish. These are more of the studio headphones. Uh, they actually come with this extension um, in the box. We'll get to the box later. But uh, they come with that extension and uh, they also come with the uh, 3.5 millimeter to that kind of uh, amp amplifier adapter. So. Uh, these headphones, they sound great, and they look great, and they're not the same price as Beats by Trey. So going into more specifics, uh, these headphones right here, they sound great. You can hear the bass quality, and I'm going to give you a little story of uh, when I tried Beats by Trey. Um, this kid had them at school, and I tried them on, and I put on like a pretty bass song on my, my iPhone. And uh, it sounded like absolute crap. It, it was like if I had a speaker with a, a, like an actual speaker with a blown speaker. It sounded absolutely horrible. And he's like, I asked him, I was like, are these like blown? He's like, no, they, they always sound like that. I was like, wow, I, I can get some headphones like these and they sound much better. So I have enjoyed using these. I use this on the car ride, three hour car ride and they're pretty good. So, um, 25 to 30 dollars. They look good. Um, you're just gonna have to like take my word for it. I have been using them, and uh, I, I wish I could demo it for you with my music library. But I mean, the, the audio doesn't really translate. But it does sound great. It's cheap. They look really good. I'm gonna give you kind of a panoramic uh, view like this. You see on the top we got the Wicked Audio. It's kind of like that white and black lettering. Looks really cool. Going around you can see that we got this kind of like moves out. So if you have a really fat head, small head, um, it it works out for whatever head, crazy abnormal head you got. So uh, you can go ahead and do that. Um, the one downside I did have uh, about them, I didn't like how uh, the headphones, the uh, like audio wires, they didn't split into one. It's not a huge deal, but I definitely would uh, like if they split into one. So that would be the only downside. But other than that, they are great, and that's with both headphones. Uh, they they go into two each side. So I wish that it went into one, and they kind of did some magic, crazy wiring magic. I don't know, and they went into one. So that's that would probably be my one downside, but it's not a big deal. Um, looking at the headphone jack itself, I did not have any problems sticking it in, in any holes. Um, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack if all of you perverts out there. I didn't have any problems sticking into my iPhone hole uh, headphone jack 
or my iPhones, like I didn't have any issue connecting it with any devices. So it's a standard 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and the Wicked Reverb, which are these studio kind of based ones. Um, these ones actually don't, these ones actually do come with the uh, adapter to the bigger kind of headphone jack. So um, these headphones all together, they sound great. They look good, and they're not the price of Beats by Dre. So guys, I hope you like this video. I hope this review is kind of helping you guys for those uh, Christmas wishes. Maybe if you're getting Beats by Dre, or you want your parents to get your Beats by Dre, or if you're buying yourself a Christmas present, uh, I'm sorry that nobody else is buying you a Christmas present, but if you want to buy yourself a Christmas present, I would not suggest Beats by Dre because they're crazy expensive, and uh, anything else does the job. Either it's these or something else. I mean, I'm just giving you a suggestion here. Wicked Reverb and Wicked Audio Airline Specials. Taking a quick look at the box. The box looks great when you first get it. Um, you can see that the headphones go right there. You got all your um, kind of like instructions, packets, stuff like that all right there. And uh, they look great. Um, they're a little ripped open from when I opened these. And then right here is the Wicked Reverb, which are the red ones. And you can see that it does come with this, and it also does come with an extension. So, uh, yeah, the boxes look great. Um, it's not like cheapy packaging. One last thing I forgot to mention on the airline specials, these ones right here, it has a um, audio uh, kind of like volume right here. So it's really cool because you can go ahead and set your audio without touching your iPhone. These apparently do not, but um, it's not a necessary feature. You can always pull out your iPhone out of your pocket. I mean, I don't think it's that big of an issue, but it's nice to have, and uh, that's only on the airline specials. The reverbs do not have them. So guys, I hope you liked this video. hope this review summed up the Wicked Reverb and the Wicked Airline specials. So links in the description will be to purchase them or just check them out on the Wicked site. So guys, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.